one third coming down. And then we're going to draw a shape in water, just of a larger poppy, medium size, connected to the larger poppy. Mid size one out here, small one in here, another mid size, another small one. Okay, first we're going to start with some permanent rows. We're going to add little permanent rows into each one of these. Okay, now I'm going to go into a darker red, use some alizarin crimson. Actually do it across the top above where the water is. I'm going to work it down. Then I'm going to use some burnt sienna. Give a little darker tone to it. The base of it. A little brown matter. You can darken up more. Okay. Then we'll even throw in a little French blue to get even darker towards the base. All using a one inch flat brush. There we go. I'm going to clean out the brush. I'm going to tip up this watercolor paper. You put masking tape underneath it, let it tip up a little bit. In fact, I'll hold it up and I'll tip it up more. I'll take a small brush, wet it a little bit, drop it on, try to get drops come down. Maybe add a little more red to it. There. Get it to drip. There we go. Doesn't have to go straight. Get each one to drip. There we go. Now we've got stems coming down. Okay, now I want to get a background. I'm going to go into a one half inch brush, chiseled edge. I'm going to go into a rolling yellow, it's kind of a darker yellow. I'm going to wet the background down. Actually, I should wet it up first a little bit. Slightly damp. So you get more water. Putting a little clear water in here so it runs better. Keep me away from the flowers itself. And work it down here. Down in there. Now, pick up this darker bright yellow. in here. Also let's put a sun over here. Put a round sun. There we go. Oh, the sun coming over the hill. Let's bring more of the yellow down in. Get more yellow coming across. More yellow. There we go. 
now. More yellow. Okay, starting to come forward. Okay, there we go. And a little bit more yellow. Now to brighten this up, I'll take a number eight round brush. And I'll get some of the Lizard and Crimson, and just dabble it across here a little bit in some spots. So you can see, like there's poppies further back in the field. Okay.